Hi, I'm Oscar van Deventer and this is the Magic Gears Grid. You've seen the video of the Magic Gears Grid before and this video was made to show you uh, the answer to two questions. One of the questions was how do you put this together and the other question was why was I surprised that it worked. So getting uh, to the first question first, how do you put this together? Well the answer is very simple, you have to move all the gears at once. So there we go and you just take it apart as a single block. Okay. And there it dis disintegrates. And putting it back together is uh, quite a puzzle because you have to move all the parts uh, well together. So getting to my uh, the second question, why was I surprised that everything works? Well, when I put together two of these uh, gears They turn without any slack. When I add a third gear, and there we go, and you see that it takes a bit of effort, it turns and the red gear has some slack. So um, that works. Now I'm going to add a fourth gear, that will be this one, and again this is taking some effort to get everything aligned. There we are. So this turns and as you can see the red gear has no slack at all. And actually when I would try to add another gear uh, around it, it wouldn't fit and it jams. And also for configuration that is uh, like this, uh, one green in the middle surrounded by three green and three red around that. This combination also jams and doesn't turn at all. So that was the reason why I was surprised. The question that I have to you today is a question that uh, I have asked already several times for some of my contraptions. Is there any practical use of this type of gearing? Thank you for watching.